It's great to see you guys today. You're doing a tremendous job. And may I say right off the bat, Pierce, it's great to have you out of that evil CNN and back where you belong in London. And the beautiful Susanna, uh-huh. I am going to reinstitute, reinstitute my beauty pageants because you look tremendous today. <laughs> Johnny, you reigned for years as king of talk show hosts. Well, now we're talking. What was the secret of your success? <laughs> you know, Jimmy, I'd love to answer that, but I don't work on Mondays. Hold on, son. Wait a minute, baby. Nobody comes back here. Oh, I'm tired of eating squirrels, son. Oh! Larry, this is not about me. It's about the American people, plain and simple. But it's your party, so aren't you going to be the candidate? See, now, Larry, why do you make assumptions? That's just propaganda. Now, we're going to have all kinds of candidates. I'll just be one. We're going to have regular American folks running for president. We're going to have all kinds. Midgets, crack whores, everything you can think of. Hey, uh, hey what are you looking at, bud, Ed? Hey, why don't you make like a tree and get out of here? You know, that, that, that is a great line. That, I mean, that is so great. You know. The stuff you guys are doing with the 50s and everything. You know, I, I had jackets like this. Can you believe that? I'm the, I'm the old guy. You, know. you, you, you need to see. Because it, it, seeing is important. And if you can't see, then, then, you, then, you, then you don't know what you're looking at. Oh, yes, thank you. Yes, tell the guy sitting at home going, what the hell is going on there? Yes. Then there's a kid going, that's not the way. Yes. Then he's like, Martha Graham, Martha Graham, and ball and chain and kick and ball. And yeah. Yes, thank you. Uh, I'm in Magic Mud. <laughs> magic Mud, Magic Mud, Magic Mud. Whole bunch of naked people walking around. If your wife hasn't been laid, of course she's going to go and see it. Either that or Fifty Shades of Grey. Take my wife. Please, take her. No. No. I am only fooling. I, I, I love my wife, but she don't know how to cook. Her cooking is so bad. It's, it's terrible. If I walk into this kitchen <laughs> and I see a cantaloupe <laughs> on that table, I will lose my mind. <laughs> Hello, America. <laughs> and those of you from Nantucket, Listen, here's the thing, Steve. Uh, here's the thing. Uh, swear to God. Um, listen, Steve, the fact is, I, listen, I do every movie, Steve. I'm everywhere. Listen, it's me, Dwayne Johnson, and Meryl Streep. Swear to God, that's all you get. You know what I mean? It's just that. Bop, 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 mm, bop, bop, bop. Can't keep a good man down, can you, Bruce? Can you? You look at me when I'm talking to you, son. Hi, Shaq, how are you? I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> um, I see you doing a lot of commercials these days. You know, I played a long time in basketball. It's one of the most dominant sides. <laughs> but I have a lot of fun doing the commercials. I actually have a few like, oh, y'all know all my commercials, but I've always been a renaissance man. Hey, you know, uh, Jim Brewer and, and, and these guys has got all these great impressions, you know? So I, I said, Oh, I, I better learn some impressions. So, are you guys all ready? This, this is my newest impression of these and a lot of it. Because here's uh, Ed Sullivan. And I'm, I'm like, he's really going to do Ed Sullivan? Like, why would you? He goes, Ed Sullivan introducing the Beatles. And he goes, ladies and gentlemen, it's, it's the Beatles. Well, I, I got to work on that one a little bit. Listen, this ain't even a hold on, fam, because... <laughs> Because look, this is the real. What we not gonna do is, you know, you ain't gonna put me in no full focus. That's not gonna happen, fam. <laughs> also, fam. My name is Dwayne The Rock Johnson. <laughs> uh, 
uh, known as the champ. Um, here doing... Trump <laughs> has a very similar voice. You know, it's wonderful that we're here in New York, Stone. I want to show you some real estate while we're up here. Own it, own it, own it, own it, own it, own it, and own it. And that one I sold to a Japanese conglomerate, and they took a bath on it. That was a very good deal. Now, now the way I understand it, Dr. Kane said that Miss Marple said that the knife that was found in the back of Sir Reginald was the same knife that was used in the kitchen by the maid Winnie Annie that originally belonged to the gardener Ben Harper who used it to scrape putty off the cellar window. Now, now, now somebody's lying here. <laughs> I'm John Mulaney, I'm on Jimmy Kimmel, and I'm loving it. It's amazing. If we do go to war, I can assure you it will not be another Vietnam, because we have learned, well, the simple lesson of Vietnam. Stay out of Vietnam. <laughs> Seth, let me start by saying I have nothing against guns. And I'm not just saying that because I look like a bullet. <laughs> My name is Morgan Freeman, and I have been talking like this since I was just a young boy. I gotta say, I gotta say this, why, why did it take so long? That's my question. I should have been had me and Oscar. You seen me. Y'all seen me. You, you, see, you seen me do Dream Girl? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Kevin, how are you? Nice to see you. Oh, shut up, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> they like it. I worked on something just for this moment. <laughs> okay. I had to write it down. Uh, whoa. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. ah. Here it is. Here it is. I said, so popo. <laughs> uh, uh, I said, Denzel, we got the mariachi band coming for you. He said, oh, mariachi? All right. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right, mariachi. So you got... <laughs> you got a mariachi band. Who dares bother the all and powerful wizard of Oz? Oh, my God, what an incredibly wonderful place. <laughs> but who the heck knows your decorating? Silence! <laughs> Whoa, tacos for lunch. It's just, it's just, it's just, it's just the little people like Father Yellow Road, Father Yellow Whoa, lovely fancy island, Man Sigram, you know, Willy Wonka, part two. Oompa Loompa, Dooby Doo, Sigram, Dabbles, and Gobstopper. Not that funny, but fun to say. And we're dancing. And we're back home on Madonna. Madonna Conway, where's the ice cream? I don't know, but I'm turned on the inside. It was amazing. It's wonderful. Because I met up with a guy who's made out of straw. I said, hey, man. Whoa, hey, man. Straw. That's a joke right there. Hi. <laughs> Trick or train. That's a damn good question. <laughs> Trick, treat, quite the conundrum. <laughs> Having said that, my young costumed friends, <laughs> as fate would have it, I too have a question. <laughs> Which one of you little kids can guess what I've buried under my house? <laughs> hey, kids. Yo, everybody just needs to like <laughs> chill, you know what I mean? Like, listen, like chill, like, you know, there's like a lot of stuff happening. Okay, I know what you're trying to say, but this is what I'm trying to say. Black lives matter, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I ate the whole thing. <clears throat> All my friends are saying mean things. Hurt my feelings. Shack a big strong man outside. But soft inside. Shack hate bullets. Everyone is calling Shack dumb. But Shack not dumb. I have a doctorate. Charles is the dumb one. Charles probably think doctorate is a girl doctor. Shack a boy doctor. He said, I went over there and he made me Franks, boy, Pop Franks. It. That's why I'm gonna always be cool with Eddie, because he may be them Franks. <laughs> and when I was young, they used to call me Fat Murphy. 
I know that, that, that you know that, that I know that, that, that you know. And if you knew that I knew that, then, then, then we both would know if, if we knew. Oh, that carpet, the way it goes from wall to wall, just doing what it does, multiple colors, and I walk on you, sweet carpet. Hip <coughs> to do well, this. Oh, no, it's real simple, Dave. <laughs> it's real simple. All I got to do is let go of the illusion that I exist. <laughs> Drive around in my Lincoln. <laughs> Rolling this booger. <laughs> hey, what's up, man? All right, cool. Good to see you, Rock. All right. What we got here? What we got here? Okay, we got all the show shot. We got shot right here. Okay, cool. Hey. Boss man. Oh, oh, no, son. That costs $200,000. I should have got a goldfish. Well, no, no, Jimmy, I, 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 I know what you're saying. <laughs> I'm aware of what you're trying to say. And the answer is yes. Did you see the interview that Shaq did right after they won the championship? The dude that was interviewing him was more excited than he was. So Shaq, how do you feel? I feel good. I just want to thank my mother, thank my father and everybody, you know, making sure you know, I get the right way and everything like that. I just want to thank everybody, you know, for supporting the locals and everything like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to do you know, the best that I can and everything like that. You know what I'm saying? I just want... You know what? I, I do this one, but I never talk about it. I do Jason Statham, and I say, I'm the transporter, and what I will do, I'll punch you in the face and have sex with me girl right on top of your corpse. <laughs> Jay, I noticed that your dog was in here a moment ago. <laughs> your dog? Love it has no tail that's crazy <laughs> this is president obama reacting to donald trump's entrance at the rnc uh who do you think you are uh, you ain't the rock i'm barack do you smell la 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 la, la what barack is cooking uh what do you want morgan well i've been thinking about this for quite a while <laughs> <laughs> not really sure what i want let's see a big mac quarter pounder with cheese let's see one or the other <laughs> so just like him Absolutely. believe it or not that's what I do. <laughs> let's see. Uh, let's just go with fries. <laughs> when you come you out, there. you're very flowy and very high pitched and very outgoing, <laughs> and you're on move and you're looking and you're singing and you're sexy and unbuttoned and fantastical. Dave, who wanna go to Africa? <laughs> Africans don't even wanna go to Africa, and they live there. <laughs> when there's something strange. <laughs> in your neighborhood <laughs> who are you gonna call <laughs> that's right ghostbusters so uh what i need you to do is uh you know uh take it off and uh <laughs> I i'll put a nouveau ring on it i don't know i don't know i don't know, I don't know. I don't know. whatever whatever stop well basically this is your voice and <laughs> I don't know how you feel about it, but I don't even know if it's that good, but <laughs> this is the voice. It's Halloween. A lot of people are dressing up, of course, as ghosts and witches and goblins and vampires. But this year, I've decided I'm going as the scariest creature in the world, my ex-wife. <laughs> they look under the seats, they're probably going to get a copy of 444. <laughs> Who the hell are you? <laughs> you know, I had a pretty good career, considering the fact that I didn't even finish college. And a reporter over at the Times found out about this. And he asked me point blank. He said, Mr. President, were you a dropout? I said, what? He said, were you a dropout? I said, no, no, I, I was cesarean. <laughs> I'm so sexy. <laughs> Look at my ass. Another day, another $50,000. <laughs> Sound like they fucking.
Puff the Magic Dragon, <laughs> uh, huffed and puffed, and then kept puffing and puffed some more, and then he like got some Oreos with his friends. <laughs> Quiet, please. <laughs> a home run and a triple. A first baseman's glove, a catcher's glove, and Dolly Parton. <laughs> Name two big hits, two big myths. Check a treat. <laughs> Smell my feet. <laughs> Give me something good to eat. Be <laughs> physical. Just you know how LeBron. Just, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> let's go, bro. Well, let's go, bro. Right? <laughs> <laughs> so sometimes you know you might hear me talking like Arnold Schwarzenegger. A lot of people think that when you talk like Arnold, you have to go, ah, 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 but you idiot, Arnold doesn't talk like that. Dennis Murphy has this real kind of sing-song way of talking, <laughs> but he always gets things, he's like an old kind of news reporter, but he always gets stories about like young kids like murdering each other or something. <laughs> so I'll be like, you know, Katie and Kara were BFFs. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, they had just bought the new Future album that had just dropped, and they were Smoking Kush and twerking. <laughs>